If you haven't done so yet, make sure you pause the video and reread the problem before listening on. The question is asking us to determine the number of coulombs of charge moving through a calculator if 1.8 times 10 to the power of 20 electrons move through it. So what we're essentially doing is taking the number of electrons and calculating the number of coulombs of charge. And for us to do that, we do need to know that one electron carries a charge of negative 1.6 times 10 to the power of negative 19th coulombs. That's a fundamental fact about the electron that you may wish to memorize. And at this stage, we can take the given quantity of the question. It says 1.8 times 10 to the power of 20 electrons. And then what we're gonna do is set up a conversion factor. And you might wanna pause the video and see if you can set up the conversion factor first. You're trying to cancel out the electrons so that your answer is left in coulombs. And we can see from our conversion that one electron would be equivalent to negative 1.6 times 10 to the negative 19th coulombs. And we have arranged the conversion in this fashion strategically because we want these electrons to cancel. And the only way for them to cancel is if we put the electrons of our conversion factor in the denominator. That way they are diagonally situated, they divide out and cancel, and that would give us our proper setup. So now you would just pick up your calculator and enter that in. And when you do so, you should get negative 28 0.8 coulombs is the final unit of your answer, and indeed this is the correct answer to the question.